Hey, what's up? It's Jang here from ultimatercom and this is a quick RC painting tips video to cover the topic of tinting your windows. Now, truth be told, I didn't think that this was a topic that was really worthy of me doing an entire video on it, but so many of you asked me to do this video. Well, here it is. Tint. What is tint? Tint is basically a semi-transparent or translucent color or pigment or shade that's applied to something so that you can get a little bit of a, a tinge of color or a tinge of darkness and still be able to see through it. Window tint is something that's very common on full-scale cars. The question is, how do you get it onto an RC car body? Well, it's very simple. What is tint? Semi-translucent paint. You get semi-translucent paint for RC cars and you put it on your body. Um, from the Pactra brand, the, the Testers RC car uh, specific paint for Lexan, they make one that's called window tint. When you finish painting your body, you take your window masks, you pull them off and you spray on window tint. You let it dry and there you go, your, t your windows are tinted. From Tamiya, if you like to use Tamiya paints, they make one that's called smoke. And it's really simple to see when you're getting a semi-translucent or semi-transparent uh, color because usually the caps indicate that. You can see through the caps part way. Tamiya uses what they call smoke. It's PS31. And like I said, you just spray it on. The more that you spray on, you can see that the, the rear side windows here have a little bit more tint to them. That's because I actually uh, sprayed on an extra coat there. The more you spray on, the darker it will be, but you always want to use light coats, as is always the case with all paints that are sprayed. Use light coats, let them dry in between. If you want to build up more, just add more coats. But, okay, that's regular tint, but then what about bodies like this, where I've got a colored tint to it, or like this? Again, another colored tint. Well, again, you look for those caps that have the <laughs> translucent uh, uh, makeup to them. And you can see that this is, uh, this is actually a metallic green paint from Pactra. It's not specifically designed to be uh, a, just a translucent uh, uh, tint. Uh, it's just meant to be backed with a silver color. It's kind of a, almost a candy color. Speaking of candy, uh, this is an older can of Pactra paint, but they make a series of paints called candy, which is just for making a candy style paint job where you build up a whole lot of a translucent color and then you back it with silver. Any of those will work and will give you the desired effect. Um, with Tamiya paints, most of them that are translucent, again, of course they have the translucent caps, but they're in the frost series. So I've got frost yellow, frost pink, frost light blue. They also have a translucent medium blue. Again, you finish up painting your body with your normal paints and then um, at the last or second to last step, you've got your window mask. You just take your window masks off, paint on the translucent paint and there you go. You've got translucent windows with a little bit of tinge of color to them or if you just use window tint paint or to me a smoke, then it comes out like so. That's all there is to it. There's no super trick to it. There's nothing special. There's no uh, old ancient secrets to it. Just use the right paint, translucent paint, paint it on and you're done. The only thing to look out for is that these translucent paints, um, uh, they're very thin and when they go on, they can really show up any dusts, dust or specks of lint that are in your windows. So you want to really pull off your, your window masks and immediately take it out and paint it before it has any chance to pick up dust and lint from the environment. Uh, just from walking around, you'll be kicking up uh, stuff from the floor and stuff. So that's that. That's that tip. Hope that was useful for you guys who were asking and begging for this specific video. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you on the friendly forums at ultimatercom Bye for now.